So what is up you guys, this is Mick with Fresh on the Fleet, good morning. Oh man, uh, if you guys can see, late start, you know how it goes. So I'm gonna get in here, and see what they got. Good morning. That's how it is. Again, if you guys are loving the videos, so hit that like button, it really does help me out a lot. Look, they got the Estee Lauder, like, silk scarf right here. 99 cents. Sorry about the wind up here, but, dude, this thing is sick. So check these out. I had to come over here because there's way too many people, but I did find these in the sunglasses. They are um, Austrian made Playboy aviator style. So surprising enough, the comps on these are actually blew my mind. So yes, yeah, definite pickup, $2.99. That's crazy. So check out the vintage Puma here, $2.99. Check the tag. That is crazy, man. The only print on here is this. It's lightweight. Check out the vest, man, for the ladies, man. This is RL67 Marine Sailing Team, 20 bucks. It's brand new with the tag, man. Look, there's the 92 Belton T that I was looking for. I let it go last time. Shout out to the Naughty Nauticals, right? Mm. Look at the women's bootleg here. I gotta love it. So check this out, the little silk bomber jacket. <laughs> Still here, but the reason why I didn't pick it up was it's got shoulder pads, that's the reason why. So I mean, those could be removed, but... And it's crazy finding it again, I thought someone bought it. Found a little Tommy here. I have no idea about this tag though, that's funny. So peep the tag, $1.99, shout out to the Golden Girls, you know what I'm talking about, let's see if I can name them. Rose, Blanche, Dorothy, and Sophia right there. Oh yeah. So check out what I came up on here. This is a number one collection, size medium, $1.99. The shirt is really weird looking, it's like an old style shirt, you can see it's single stitch. But check this out. So this is from a 1930s movie. It's a French movie. I don't know, Liage d'Or? Liage d'Or or something like that? Can't even say it, but yeah. Check out the movie you want. It's a crazy piece finding this in the thrift, but picking it up. So you guys, check out this teats. <laughs> so the tag kind of freaked me out. I thought it was a Supreme for a second, and then read what it says. I'm not a gynecologist, but I'll take a look. Oh man, look at this. One of those Tupac tees, this is 2014. Come on, come on. That's pretty cool coming up on a Hall of Fame tee. Pete Rose, it's all cracking. <laughs> look, coming up on a guest embroidered shirt. I know this tag. Look at that. Taxing though. 
So check out what I found. It's a Budweiser X Bintrill uh, T. The back. That's how it goes, you guys. I am taking off from there to pick up a few shirts, uh, as well as those Playboy Made in Austria sunglasses. On to the next trip. Let's go. We here. It's all empty. What? Nice. Polo v neck. Let's see how much you're taxing in this place. Not bad, actually. Loving it, man. SNLT. This is a pretty clean piece for $1.99. Check out the pocket. Check this out, 93. This is my childhood right here, Red Dragons, man. If you guys haven't seen that skate video, check it out. Check this out, Absolute Vodka, Best of LA Festival, 97. Reprint. Thought it was an original. The high fashion. Checking the shoes. Kobe. Look at the chillin' fly knits here. I have these in white. Oh, these are my size, eight bucks. Check them out. So you guys who remembers this one, 93, TV Teddy, man, he's missing his stuff, but see, he still turns on. So too bad, you guys, I found this fanny pack. I thought this was one of those bootleg Gucci ones but it's not, and I did find this. It is an authentic Shivanshi leather interior, like clutch bag, it's got the big G's in there. But I don't see it, the tag, looks like it's been ripped off. So update you guys, I did find the price, look at that, $2.99. As well as that, I found these Tom Ford um, suit covers for the box logos, man. One like three ninety nine for each. Very nice. Haven't came up with some cap in a long time. Check out the embroidery. Size medium. Check out the older tag. Not bad. Look at the Spanglish jacket. It's like a nice puffer, man. Down. There we go, we got some uh, nice little Tommy vest here. Very plain, just for the embroidery here. Damn, taxing. So I found out this thing was actually flipped um, inside out. So the inside is actually supposed to look like this, and then this was the outside. I was wondering, why does it look like that? All leather, man. 
So I'm leaving there right now. I did pick up a few things, man. Something crazy happened. This guy, he put on uh, one of the shirts and he just walked out with it. So the security or the manager is actually following right now. Let's go. So boom, what is up you guys? This is Mick Professional Fleet. So yes, I'm bringing you the recap in the madness of what is my room. Let's get into it. So first pick was this, $1.99. Again, if you guys look this up. So I did find out how to say this thing. So it's large door. It really is like large door. So. <laughs> large door it is a 1930s movie and it pretty much is a movie about uh, I believe it's two young couple and they got married and they need to consummate their marriage if you know what I'm talking about right you know now. what I'm talking about right? so it is a beautiful piece so it's a number one collection tag I have no idea what year again but the embroidery is beautiful on this thing dollar 99 but you can't put a price on history so another pick right here it is a bin trail X Budweiser tea so they were taxing a little bit 499 for this thing and this thing came out last year and is in impeccable condition but the weird part is the print is actually like it's hard it's hard it's weirdly like imprinted on the shirt the pocket tee right there it does say ben trill right on the tag there decent piece <laughs> <laughs> so that i did find this shirt right here it's on a fruit of the loom i've seen the original of this this is a dollar 99 but look what it says so it does say if you see the police warner brother and it's just so funny because if you guys see this thing it looks like the warner brothers uh, logo on there $1.99 steel size medium now onto another T and I love this one man $1.99 again size medium I wish it was a large for my size but it says live from New York it's you guys already know Saturday Night Live that is beautiful it says SNL Saturday Night Live um, best thing about this it's not just a printed shirt like it's not just a gildan and then they left the whole tag it actually has its own tag this was a 2010 Saturday Night Live Print and you can actually see it on the tag right here, Saturday Night Live. That was actually licensed by Saturday Night Live, and for $1.99, it's insane. So, another T right here, finding it because look, it's a polo by Ralph Lauren vintage shirt. Let me show you this. So, this is a polo Ralph Lauren established 1967 New York. That is beautiful. Look at the print on this thing, it's like on a patch again, size medium. Again, always good getting low for the low. A crazy piece right here, it is on a Kappa Gara. It says AGSS going down the side, it does have the Kappa logo embroidered in there. Beautiful embroidery. It's got that classic logo going down the side, just like the pants. Now, everyone has this misconception about this picture. Everyone believes these are two girls back to back. These aren't two girls back to back. Originally, this is a guy and this is a girl. So the crazy part about this, again, I'm gonna give you guys a little tidbit about the history of Kappa, is that back then, again, Kappa comes from Italy, they were taking pictures for the logo. They didn't know what it was gonna be. They had different ideas. And when they were on a break, okay, when they were on a break, they actually took a still shot of the two people that were in the actual logo resting back to back. So this was an impromptu thing that happened and that's the logo you see today. That's a man and that's a woman. The more, the you, more know. you know. So I did pick this one for $3.99 size medium, fits like a large. So I did pick up the Shivanshi mini like purse, um, all leather. Again, that's the crazy thing about this. Usually when I find Shivanshi, they're always the Shivanshi perfume. Usually they're giveaway bags and usually they represent the perfume part aspect. If you find Gucci perfume or, or Versace perfume stuff. This on the other hand, it's got those G's going through there. That was the most amazing thing. This thing was flipped inside out and it turns out that it was flipped the wrong way. And again, I got it for $2.99. Did have to ask about that though. See, if I would have brought this to the front, again, they would have said, you know, you can't buy it. That's the thing. A lot of people usually just say, the piece is super clean. Last but not least, and definitely, definitely the cop of the day, it is these 1980s vintage Playboy aviators. Now, these are insane, man. I'm gonna put these on right now. So these are insane, I mean, Finding them at the thrift in the pile. That is the craziest thing. I've already come up on glasses every time almost I've gone. And last time I came up on the Versace ones. So that's crazy. And I looked it up. Made in Austria. These are 4929.20. They didn't see any quality in it at the thrift shop. So they, again, they priced it the way they thought. So they put them at $2.99. I mean, you can see the quality on the make of them. Uh, again, all glasses, like you'll feel kind of like a quality to them. As well as look at the screws in there. As you can see, flat heads. Um, none of that Phillips stuff, if you know what I mean. The lenses are fully dark as well as minimal scratches on them, so I'm very happy about that. And again, that's the style. And again, that's the style. Yes, I want to thank you guys for watching. And with that said, I'm remind you guys do hit on my Depop, Fresh and Fleet, and also hit on my Big Cartel, freshandfleet.bigcartel.com. Get fresh, and I'm gonna say what I always say. Hit that sub button, some more videos are coming. This is Mick from Fresh from the Fleet.